the vomit riff from Hourglass. This riff, when I first learned it, probably kicked my ass the most. Especially if you're new to playing uh, Lamb of God riffs or just new to playing metal in general. Um, so one thing to keep in mind with this riff, it's not necessarily the notes, it's how you finger the notes. I thought I'd have to play it with like, you know, my middle two fingers and do something like that. And you can do that. It's easier though to do it with your index and your middle finger though. So something like this. For whatever reason, for me, that works the best. First part goes like this. Open, 12, 13, 12, 13, 12, 13, 12, 13, 11, 13, 12. Right, so that's the first part. And we're alternate picking this entire riff. And it's kind of palm muted too, except for the accent notes. Second half, we're gonna go open, 12, 13, 12, 13, 12, 11, 12, 10. Still th these two fingers. Then we're gonna do a little walk down on 13, 12, and 11 on the A string. Here's the second part, slow. So the first part and the second part together now. The third section is the same as the first one. Section four starts off the same way as all the others. We have open 12, 13, 12, 13, 12. But unlike the other ones, we come down here to the fifth fret now. Let's play five, eight, four, seven, six, three on the low E string. Some tabs will tell you to slide from seven with your pinky to six. I like to pull off to my ring finger to get to six and then pull off from my ring finger to the third fret with my index. So it'd be something like this. I feel like it sounds cleaner. Section four slow. All right, now the whole thing's slow. Section one. Section two. Section three. Section four. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this edition of Rift Breakdown with Hourglass. Uh, if you like this, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more content like this. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.